The verdict for a mommy blogger who falsely accused a couple of trying to kidnap her children. ABC's Mona Kosar Abdi has more on this case that also involved a video viewed more than four million times. Mona, good morning. Wait, good morning. Katie Sorensen told the elaborate lie on a since-deleted Instagram video that you just mentioned, claiming a Latino couple she described as not clean-cut tried to kidnap her children. Her story falling apart after the false allegations went viral. This morning, a popular social media influencer who falsely accused a couple of trying to kidnap her children now convicted of lying about the whole ordeal. Monday of this week, my children were the targets of attempted kidnap. 31-year-old Katie Sorensen, a mom influencer who posted beauty and motherhood advice, uploaded this video that was viewed more than 4 million times. And I want to share that story with you in an effort to raise awareness as to what signs to look for. Falsely claiming that strangers tried to kidnap her two young children on December 7, 2020, outside the Petaluma, California Michaels store. The Sonoma County DA's office says the videos were posted about a week after Sorensen reported the supposed kidnapping attempt to police. In the video, Sorensen described a number of details about the alleged incident that hadn't been disclosed to police. The accused couple, Sadie and Eddie Martinez, say they actually recognize themselves in this photo and came forward to deny Sorensen's claims. She wanted a stronger following. She was looking for, you know, content for her fame and her her income um, and at our expense. Sorensen's attorney maintains his client did not lie to police. She misperceived and misunderstood a series of random events which were occurring around her and made a honest report to the police on December 7th. Her attorney adding that it was when Sorensen reviewed the evidence that she realized she was wrong. I don't think she had any understanding of how this would spread and the impact it would cause. But some legal experts say this verdict is about accountability. This is a woman who lied for clicks at the expense of a couple in California who wrongly accused them of a very serious crime. And a sentencing date has not been set yet for Sorensen. Her crime, though, carries a maximum of six months in jail, Janae. A crazy story there, Mona. Thank you.